Hi guys, this is Alex from BlackboxMyCar.com. Today, I have a comparison review of T-Power Plus Alpha versus Selling Battery B. Earlier this week, we shot a video about the Selling Battery B. If you want an overview about that Selling, please see the link in the description below. T-Power Plus Alpha and Selling are the two most debated and the most popular dashcam batteries out in the market today. Koreans have been using dash cams as early as 2006 and parking mode has been a main concern for the Korean people. Cars are expensive and streets are narrow, car gets hit or run and vandalized quite often. Korean companies thought why not integrate a parking mode feature into the dash cam. And this is why if you are looking for a device to monitor your vehicle, you have to go with a Korean device. I'm not trying to upsell you to more expensive Korean devices. The reason why I'm pointing out this is because many, many, many people contact us for questions regarding parking mode on their Chinese devices. Some Chinese devices may have the parking mode feature, but the company themselves don't understand what's the need for it. And thus, these companies don't even test this feature well, or refine it to make it work better. We don't know what the long-term reliability of these Chinese devices if it is constantly powered, unlike the Korean dash cams. For those who are trying to extend parking mode, T-Power will give you about 14 hours and then it moves over to the car battery for the next 8 to 10 hours depending on your car battery's condition. Installation for the T-Power Plus Alpha is actually a lot easier and simpler than the Selink. The reason being is, as you can see, the cables are going to be very easy to install. You have two different ways to install your T-Power. One way is to simply plug it into the cigarette lighter jack and power up your T-Power. Or if you want to fully take advantage of your T-Power uh, to extend your parking mode, most people use these hard wire kits. As you can see, ground, ACC wire, black, and the red wire is going to be the, the battery fuse. So, this wire goes into the fuse that always has power, and ACC fuse is not is going into a fuse that doesn't have power when the vehicle goes off. So basically, just like the Power Magic Pro installation, and that's it. Very simple and straightforward. Very easy to hide just because of the size of the device. As you can see, it is very very small compared to the Selink, so it is a lot easier to hide if you're willing to simply put it under the under the seats or even within your fuse box. Selink is designed differently and it is designed to use its own battery power. Please do watch the other video that I created for the Selink is that this device is actually a, a, a solution to a lot of BMW owners who have installed the dash cams and who are using the parking mode. But after several years relying on your car battery, if you don't drive enough or if you don't charge your battery, your car battery can get very weak and you have to eventually change the battery. And this is expensive to exchange your car battery. And Selling decided to come out with a, a battery pack that you can simply rely on its battery power without having to use the car battery. So T-Power and Lucas battery packs work in a way that your dash cam uses your car battery first and then it moves over to the battery pack. Think of it as a Power Magic Pro with a battery inside. So you're still using your car battery and once it gets to a point 11.8 or 12.0 V, it cuts off and it moves over to its own dedicated battery pack. This puts a lot of stress on your vehicle, especially if you're living in a colder environment. By the way, Lucas battery pack is not designed for all the dash cams. If your dash cam has internal voltage cutoff feature, which a lot of new dash cam nowadays have, you are going to have a problem. And it is the weakest out of all and not really designed for a dash cam after all. So we don't actually recommend the Lucas battery pack if you're looking for a dedicated dash cam battery pack. We strongly recommend the T-Power Plus Alpha or the Cellink. Selink is equipped with 6,000 milliamp battery pack and the Selink B is using lithium iron phosphate batteries which are the latest in the lithium battery technology used in the new power supplies. These batteries not only charge in less than a couple hours but last three to four times longer than regular lithium batteries and as you can see, you only need about an hour to fully charge this device. And once it's charged, if, depending on your dash cam, it can last up to 72 hours. Installation is a bit tricky and the manual doesn't describe it too well. So please refer to this video. I'll make it very straightforward. Three different ways to set this up. One is simply connecting it directly to the cigarette lighter jack. 
and you are going to simply connect this cable to your input. If you want to hardwire this device, two different ways. The second way is that it only charges when the vehicle is up and running. And if you just want to rely on your selling battery, then you, all you need to do is hardwire this part, which is also, again, gets connected to input. But this time you have two wires to play around with. Black wire is going to get grounded. Red wire is going to your ACC fuse. Fuse that doesn't have power when the vehicle is off. Lastly, I haven't pointed this out yet, but selling battery can also be used along with your car battery. Uh, like I said, I did say that this device is designed so that you're only relying on your battery, selling battery, but you can still use car battery after all. Simply hardwire with this guy. With this guy, it is a little bit tricky. I don't know if you can see in the video, one wire has simply just no lines whatsoever. It's just completely black. Other wire actually has this white line on this cable. So the white line is actually going into the battery fuse, fuse that has power when the vehicle is off. And the black wire is going to get grounded. And this cable gets connected to this guy, main battery tech. And again, if you're going to go with this third option, you have to use this cable and you also have to hardwire your input cable as well. But lastly, this cable right here is for the expansion pack. You can actually expand another set of Selink and believe it or not, a lot of our customers have done it already. And it gives you another same size battery, again, another 72 hours. For Selink, we actually recommend using a, a fuse adapter just because you're playing around with two very different size, especially with this guy, it's a lot thicker and a lot more sturdier. So we use, uh, we recommend using a fuse adapter. Otherwise, we don't necessarily recommend using the fuse adapter, uh, but if you want to, you could. Overall, these two battery packs are designed for the dash cams, unlike the one that I pointed out, Lucas battery pack isn't designed for it. My personal preference is the Selink. And this is because I myself have been in a situation where someone in the parking lot hit my vehicle and just parked there. And because my Blackview DR550 was running, because it was hardwired, I didn't have to pay anything to get my bumper fixed. It was above $1,200 um, damage on my front bumper. When I reported this video evidence to ICBC, ICBC contacted the other guy. The other guy actually said he bust that day, he didn't drive that day, but once the insurance adjuster revealed that there is a video footage of him walking in front of my vehicle even, and hitting my vehicle, of course, he decided, okay, I'll pay for everything. I mean, that one case paid out my dash cam myself. So I strongly recommend using the hardwiring kit if you're going to get a Korean dash cam, use the parking mode. And if you are familiar enough with the parking mode, or if you have been using dash cams for some time, then get these battery packs so that you can maximize your dash cam basically and the parking mode. Why not? It makes sense. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. If you enjoy our videos, check out our website for more information and stay tuned for more exciting new products.